Assalamualaikum and hi everyone. Today we are going to learn the last science uh, process skill which is communicating. Okay, before this, we have already learned five science uh, process skills and I hope all of you still remember. Okay, uh, the science process skills that we have already learned are observing classifying, measuring and using numbers, making inference, predicting, and today we are going to learn the last one, which is communicating. Okay, communicating. Communicating is a skill to describe an action object or phenomenon using words or graphic symbols such as tables, graph, diagrams or models. Okay, this is an example of table atau point jadual. Graph Diagram and model. Okay, now open your textbook, page 13. Let us look at the example below. Year 3 pupils collected information about the number of pupils in their class and their favourite fruits. The information was recorded in a table. Okay, here. Okay, the information was recorded in a table. Favourite fruit, papaya. Okay, there are 8 person who likes papaya. Durian. 9, banana, 7, and watermelon, 6 person who likes watermelon. Okay, this is table, okay, jadual. Information from the table can be transferred to other forms such as a bar chart. Okay, this information inside this table can be transform into other form such as bar chart. Okay, let us look at the bar chart. Okay, so this is bar chart. Okay, favorite fruits of the peoples. Papaya, durian, banana, watermelon. So all the information from the tables before, okay, has been transferred into this bar chart. Okay, now, turn to page 14. Find activity. Sketch a face. Apparatus and materials. Pencil. A4 paper. Okay, and then the steps. Number 1. Observe your friend's face. Sketch your friend's face on an A4 paper. Or we use exercise book. Number three. Label each part of the face that you have sketched. Number four. Present your sketch in front of the class. Okay, so this is uh, activity that we need to sketch a face, a friend face. Okay, so inside your exercise book, okay, first of all, you write the day and the date and then the title, sketch a face. So here, you need to, uh, to sketch your friend's face. Okay, draw your friend's face. 
lukis muka kawan and then label. Okay, label bahagian mana yang terdapat di muka kawan kamu. Okay, let's look an example. Okay, here. Okay, here we can see Elsa. Okay, and then I have label hair, nose, eyes, ears, and also mouth. Okay, from this drawing of Elsa, we can see that Elsa has round and beautiful eyes. Elsa has long hair. And Elsa also has beautiful and sweet smile. So, this is one example of communicating activity. Okay. From this drawing, we can communicate. So, for today's task, we are going to use your science activity book. Okay, turn to page 9. Okay, here, communicating. Okay, first, you write the date. Okay, let us read the instruction. Rani investigates how her friends go to school each day. Her results are shown below. Okay, so this is the table. Ways, uh, way of traveling to school. And then number of pupils or person. Okay, walking. 6%. By bicycle, 8%. By motorcycle, 5%. And then by car. 11%. Okay, transfer the information above into a different form of communication. Okay, means that you need to transfer this information into other form. Okay, inside this box. Information from this table, you need to transfer into other form. Okay. For example, we can transfer this information into bar chart. Okay, let's look at the example. Okay, here is an example. Okay, way of traveling to school, walking by bicycle. By motorcycle, by car. Okay, we just take the information from the table, then we transfer it into this bar chart. Okay, here di tepi ini ialah number of peoples or person. So we arrange the number. Start from the lowest value. Okay, zero. We arrange until the highest value. Okay, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12. Okay, walking, 6%. By bicycle, 8%. By motorcycle, 5%. And by car is 11%. Okay, so we just take the information from the table and we transfer it into bar chart. Okay, I hope you can do this in your activity book. Okay, make sure you use a ruler to draw a straight line. Okay, that's all for today. See you again in our next lesson. Take care and happy learning.